When did things start to go bad for the Western Roman Empire? Well, believe it or not, but even in the early 400s AD, the Western Roman Empire was still doing amazingly well. The ingenious Magister Militum, the supreme general of the Western armies, Flavius Stilico, was pretty good at basically destroying all barbarian invaders. In 398, Picts attacked Hadrian's Wall but were repelled. Stilico possibly sent reinforcements, the wall was strengthened as late as 400. In 401, Stilico defeated the Vandals and Alans in Raetia and Noricum. In 402, Stilico defeated Alaric and his Visigoths at Polintia, and shortly thereafter, after again at Verona. In 405, Stilico defeated Radagaisus and his huge Germanic army and again in 406. But because of these constant attack waves, Stilico had depleted the Rhine frontier and so just shortly later, in early 407, huge masses of barbarians managed to cross the Rhine border into Gaul and Spain. That is when the beginning of the end came for the Western Roman Empire. Even though the Roman army achieved victory after victory, it was still not enough because they were just under attack from all sides all of the time. So 407 was the year when it all started going south rapidly.